What's up, my modern day ninjas? Fauchin with you once again, and once again, we are doing a let's check out. So, today, let's check out Power Star Golf. Now, if you've been following my uh, gameplay on YouTube for a while now, <laughs> this is going to seem well out of the ordinary. But the fact is, it, it, it is that it isn't. Um, I do have certain games that I like to, uh, I don't know, wind down with, if you will. So, like, if I'm playing a game that's intense, like, say, let's take, for instance, Titanfall. To where I'm, um, you know, I'm, I'm being really competitive, uh, you know, I gotta worry about what the team is doing, what have you. Uh, afterwards, I like, I like to play a wind down game, like before I, before I'm gonna get off uh, the console or what have you. So I like to do something like play golf or something relaxing like that, or uh, the best one for me was uh, Test Drive Unlimited. After a competition back in the day, my friends and my team and I would uh, jump on on that game and just drive around Hawaii for a while, you know, just goofing off. And so that's what uh, Power Star Golf, that's the type of game it is for me. So it is a game that I would normally play, you would normally find me on if, if I'm winding down at the end of the evening or something. So it's not out of the ordinary just something that you wouldn't normally see me doing on YouTube but I did want to check this out it's free uh, in this state right here so the full game obviously here uh, five courses for $20 uh, as you can see by this here I have played it before but uh, we're gonna go ahead and show you guys the training event right here uh, and this let's check out because it's a cool game, you know. I if you I guess if you enjoy golf games, it's a cool game, I should say. And while I've never played golf in real life, I do enjoy playing golf on a console. It's fun. I'm not very good at it, admittedly. Um, and that just opened many doors for make love in this step through, but F bomb him. He can say what he wants to say may not be good at it but I'm better than he is so yeah so let's get into this to take a shot press the A button as the shot bar fills press A again to set the power the triangular marker on the shot bar corresponds with your current aim distance after setting the power watch the cursor as it moves back down the bar and press A again when it reaches the center of the strike zone Timing is crucial. The farther from the center the cursor is, the less accurate your shot. Hit the red areas and you'll hook or slice the ball, sending it curving to the left or right. Miss the strike zone completely and you'll flunk the shot. So hopefully we won't make those kinds of mistakes. Uh, it doesn't say in the tutorial, but Y button lets you examine the area in which you're going to be landing assuming you don't make any crucial mistakes and so here we go Take that. To aim your shot, use the left stick. The flag indicator shows where the pin is, but aiming straight for it might not always be appropriate. To view the target area, press the Y button. The circled area shows where the ball oh, might go. stop, but doesn't account for wind or elevation. You'll need to compensate for both when aiming. Try to keep the ball on the fairway, fringe or green, as playing from a poor lie, such as rough or a bunker, can affect your shot significantly. Uh, 
that's only four inches up. I really shouldn't have added all that power. So, and all that wind condition either. Right here should be good enough. At least we're on. Nice here. on. When putting, the grid reveals the slopes in the green, helping you estimate where the ball will roll. The faster the dots move, the steeper the ground slopes in that direction. You can change the length of your putt by pressing the X button. To start the putt, press the A button. Then, as the shot bar fills, press A again to set the power and play the shot. For a birdie... It's slightly uphill. So we've got four inches uphill. And it slopes slightly to the left. So what we're going to do is... Play it to about here as far as power goes and about here but as you can see on the uh, right hand side of the screen I can hold B to get an idea of where my shots gonna be now you can only do this so many times during a, a game and since this is I mean and this is just this one hole so it's just one time uh, but uh, nonetheless I'm gonna use it see I'm off so we're gonna adjust to about here and see what we get Yeah, guys, that's a <laughs> power star golf for you. Uh, like I said, it's just a fun little game. If your friends have it, you can get into it with them and just enjoy a, a relaxing uh, evening or whatever of golfing, having fun, bragging rights, all that kind of good stuff. Uh, it's a, it's a good jaunt away from uh, playing the shooters or the racers or whatever where everything tends to seem a little more serious or, or uh, where things seem to be a little more serious or intense or what have you so yeah I think I'm gonna go ahead and drop the $20 on this game uh, do me a favor if you haven't already hit that subscribe button it really helps out a lot not to mention we've got that giveaway going on and all you have to do to be entered into that giveaway is to be subscribed uh, it's it's a cinch gaming tournament controller that I'll, I'm giving away uh, worth about a hundred dollars and so yeah hit that subscribe button but until next time I'm going to go buy this game, the full game, and uh, have some fun. And you know me, I'm Falchion, and I'm Ghost. Later. So when the haters hate, and the genuine gamers ask you how you did what you did, you can tell them what I tell them. It's a cinch.